Rachel? Mm -hmm. I mean, it reminds me so much of um, when we were in that rowboat I told you about when I was a little kid. Mm -hmm. And, and I, I loved it that you captured that movement in the water. Yeah, well, it's hard to know exactly where it's going to end up going. You start out with these movements and these colors and you start putting them together and they just sort of grow and grow on their own until they form themselves into the shape that you never even knew was going to be there when you started. So similar thing with water where they're growing organically and they just resolve themselves Absolutely. by the end. Absolutely. <laughs> and then this one over here, like this one does... Like a different thing, almost like you've caught the vegetation beneath too. And oh, that's interesting too. Um, it's the same thing where usually when I was getting myself started, I would have a particular line quality or shape that I was thinking about. But when people start talking about what they see when it's finished, it's always something completely different, whether it's a mermaid, as I heard yesterday, which I never I would have that. seen. You never know what it's going to mean to somebody else. So that's really the fun of abstract, I think. Yeah, mermaid hair. I love it. And exactly. that said, it's the experience of the, of the person who witnesses your art. Exactly. It's different for everybody. Yeah.